Hi, Andy Biting here with Tulip Media Group. Listen, I want to talk to you for a few moments about your marketing plan for 2022. Now, we're coming into a new year, and most of us plan for our business to some degree. We have some plans, we have some business strategy plans, and we have some marketing and sales plans. And when you're looking at your own marketing plan for this coming year, I want you to keep a few things in mind. The first one is, I want you to, we've all heard the acronym, the SMART goals, right? Specific, measurable, attainable, realistic, timely. Now, I want you to think a little bit differently. I want you to think about fast goals. I want you to think about your frequently discussed, ambitious, specific metrics, and transparent. I want you to think in terms of those fast goals. What are those goals to keep them alive? You need to frequently discuss them. To stretch yourself, they need to be ambitious. Forget this realistic and attainable. Who wants that? I don't want to live a life of realistic and attainable. I want to live a life. I want to live an ambitious life. And in our business, we want to live an ambitious life there as well. Now, Specific, you do need to be specific. If you don't have goals that are specific and with tying to metrics, you're not going to achieve them. And then finally, instead of being timely, have them transparent. Talk about them among your team. So I just want to start with that. But now we're going to talk about your 2022 marketing plan. Now, when you are setting your goal, the approach that I always take as a, as a business coach as well is look out a little bit more long-term. You know, Jack Welch, former CEO of General Electric, always said, I want to know where my executives are going three to five years from now. And then I want to know what their plan is over the next 90 days because I want to know where they're heading and I want to know their specific next steps because you can't predict anything in between there. So think about that for your business. Where do you want your business to be in three years from now? And what do you need to do in the next year and in the next 90 days specifically to advance yourself towards that three-year goal? So think of those terms. And when you do, you want to, we all have goals for the coming year. And if you have goals for 20% growth, 10% growth, 50% growth, whatever they, whatever they are for you, figure out what does that mean in true dollar terms. And given your current trajectory, where are you likely to hit? So in other words, if you want to grow by 40% this coming year, but you're currently on a 20% growth trajectory, well, that means you have a 20% gap there. Where's that gap going to come from? Therein lies the opportunity. Find out what your targets are, what your goals are, figure out what your current trajectory is and what is that gap. That's where you need to go out and do something different this year. And how are you going to do that? That's what you need to figure out. Okay, this is where I want you to spend some time. Now, it's different for every business. Maybe there's a combination of digital and print and interactive marketing that you can do. Whatever that combination is for your business, you need to figure that out and put it into fast goals and then frequently discuss them. Make sure they're ambitious, they're specific, and they're transparent. You're talking about them often. Figure out what that gap is. Put together a different plan. Look at your business development assembly line, your process for bring, for attracting new leads and bringing them in through the front door to a paying customer. And what does that process look like? What is the gap you need to fill in your business? And how are you going to fill that gap? Look at every opportunity. Look at every possibility. Don't leave any stone unturned in your efforts to make your business to grow your business in an ambitious way and to make your business an incredible success this coming 22, 2022 year. Good luck. And you can always reach out, chat with me anytime if I can help you out. We'll talk soon.